part of an architecture family i think design came very naturally to us and uh, it was so intriguing to go to my dad's studio and look at people drawing by hand the plans and the 3d one point and three point perspective used to be very very intriguing as a child to me so i think that's where the journey towards thinking about design and how the plans and the 3d's come together really started to happen major of our designs are more in terms of public spaces and uh, we are very very conscious that our designs should be human centric and public centric and we create projects where volumes are created which have a wow factor in it so that people want to enjoy the architecture piece and they want to be part of it so that's where our architecture starts and we want to create buildings which are functional sustainable and at the same time integrate the new technology with them large scale projects they don't happen every day these are projects which happen may probably once in your lifetime when i came back to india after doing urban design uh, chennai was a blessing in disguise to us this was the first massive mega project that our country was building in 2007 a project of 200000 square meters which has one of the largest cantilevers in india of 26 meters which has the thinnest flyover of 400 mm so there was a big transformation you know in terms of architecture where we were creating structures which are sustainable but at the same time integrating new technology so it was a great experience for us and uh, our honorable president when he inaugurated the project you know so beautiful that at 5 pm he can read his speech without a single daylight bulb is on so that kind of an experience is something that we look forward for i think we are in a very uh, interesting cusp where we have looked at projects where hand drawn drawings were done then we saw that you know cad came into picture and we started the computers udaipur airport is a prime example where we have done the full project in bim 360 degree and you can look at the project navigate it in your system coordination becomes so simpler and you are able to optimize everything so beautifully and i think with artificial intelligence how the data would play a pivotal role so that architect can probably focus in human centric designs and ai can help you in data management and can give you you know very very crisp and clear data analysis by virtue of which you can make much more simpler and efficient buildings so integrating technology with our culture is the key and something that we need to take very consciously forward what we have seen in our lifetime is that you know change is consistent so one has to uh, be adaptive whatever we create is local strongly connected with our culture but at the same time is advanced and is realized in terms of the futuristic vision and technology It's a beautiful initiative from Forbes India and Kohler. People from different professionals are giving their insight and they are sharing their experiences and I think we will learn from uh, mutual experiences to take our country forward.